Um, hi, my name is Frank Murray. I'm a mechanical design engineer at Lynn and I was design lead on the LP1250. Um, I'm going to talk to you here a little bit about the plinth. Um, one of the most important parts of an LP12 um, and one of the biggest upgrades that we're bringing to the LP1250. Um, we were working on this bedrock plinth for a good while before we started the LP1250 project but in our communications with Johnny Ive it seemed like the perfect opportunity to bring that new technology um, through and it enabled us to do several new things as well. Um, from my perspective it started off uh, looking at um, the material properties of this new um, plywood. The big aim with a plinth from our perspective is about vibration absorption and um, we want to keep the signal as distortion free as possible and with a system that's mechanical like a turntable um, we want to absorb that um, through the plinth and keep the stylus and the groove working as optimally as possible. We did laser measurements on the material raw and we found that the absorption um, from an impact or um, subtle vibration is unlike any other wood we've, we've used. So that combined with the new single piece construction machine from Solid has meant that the, the new bedrock plinth is um, more stable, more secure and enables us to mount the switch and the top plate in a way far more accurately and precise than we were able, ever able to do before. Um, a secondary benefit which comes um, from the additional mass is that we're actually altering the centre of mass slightly with the LP1250. Um, with the platter being the way that it is, the mass on the LP12 is actually slightly back left. Um, by using a heavier plinth, what we've done is we've been able to move the centre of mass more centrally due to making the platter a lesser component of the whole system, which then means that the trampoline feet are loaded more evenly and the whole system performs better. Um, separate to performance, we've also got some new design ideas. Um, the plinth is iconic and it's one of the things that is a sort of a staple of, of the LP12 uh, and for the 50th anniversary with working with Johnny Ive we wanted to make sure that we didn't stray away from what makes the LP12 iconic and um, so you'll notice that the silhouette of the new plinth is the same as before and it's nodding back to the history that this product has but on the top you'll see that there is new details in terms of the, the corners which are a unique spline profile um, and also just the general um, construction of the integrated corner braces and integrated structure um, means that this whole new plinth looks like an LP12 but has many many details that make it totally new.